Hello my peeps, Peachy Pixels here and welcome back to my Skyrim Let's Play with our awkward Argonian character Talks to Fish. So I know it's been quite a few months since I last uploaded a video. I had um initially gone through this part of the of the game where I think last episode that you've seen I was about to go fight the dragon so I ended up playing over that and uh, I had video saved up that I was going to post and then somehow the save file got corrupted and every time I try to load it I just have T-posing NPCs and it would just send me back to the main menu. Um, yeah, and I was, I think I was pretty far ahead into it and um, I ended up stopping because of that. So today I thought I'd try it again, see if I can get, you know, just restart it, that's fine. And luckily I had a save file at the exact point where I ended the last video so I can start over and it's been um, a long enough time break I guess that I can just start fresh without remembering anything I did up until this point so I thought I'd just mention that but luckily the story will continue I won't have to start a new character and um, we're just gonna go ahead and get back into it so yes Tox to fish is going to go see what all the hubbub is about with the dragon, so let's get back into it. Alright, the guards are running, we gotta get get to the dragon as well. Gotta run. Aren't you scared? This was as stupid as our feud with Clan Grey Mane. <sighs> but very slow runner, but let's try to get there as quick as possible. Catch up with all the guards and reinforcements. Go. We need to get to the Western Watchtower before it's too late. Okay. I don't see any dragons, but if you say so. Do you see him? No signs of any dragon right now, but it sure looks like he's been here. Hmm. I know it looks bad. We've got to figure out what happened. And if that dragon is still skulking around somewhere. Spread out and look for survivors. We need to know what we're dealing with. Okay. Hey! Any survivors out there? Hello? <gasps> I see someone. No, get back. It's still here somewhere. Rocky and Tor just got grabbed when they tried to make a run for it. What? Did Red save us? Here he comes again. Where? Here he comes! Find cover and make every arrow count! This is a oh, shoot! I'm ready for a fight. got any fancy arrows like you guys but maybe I can hit him with my fire attack. Oh. Hey. Take this. 
Okay, um... Obviously, that's probably not the best idea for me to go in and fight him like that, so... Let's heal up a bit and run away. <laughs> oh my gosh. This can't be the end of my adventure. He's just beaming it into me, isn't he? I, I think... I think I should probably make a run for it. Oh no! Alright guys, you, you guys handle the dragon and I'll stay in the back. It's obvious that I am no match for him. are doing a lot of damage to him. I, I really can't do much. couple of things at our disposal just in case. I kind of ran out of potions unfortunately, which really sucks, but let's try and um, see if we can uh, use something else. Oh shoot! Long range is clearly the best way to fight him. I can't. going to use our uh, we are going to use our level up and uh, level up our <laughs> our health And then we are going to use some healing spells. This is a lot more difficult than I remember. Or, I mean, this is a lot more difficult than I remember. Spells, so we're just gonna have to wait for him to drop down and see if we can attack him from there. He is just quick. Uh, 
issues that I I don't have to shut my head. Okay, let's see what this card has. I need, I need some. I need something to hit him with. I can't believe it. You're Dragonborn. I'm a Dragonborn? What do you mean? In the very oldest tales, back from when there were still dragons in Skyrim, the Dragonborn would slay dragons and steal their power. That's what you did, <gasps> isn't it? Absorb the dragon's power. What? Hmm. I think you may be right. There's only one way to find out. Try to shout. According to the old legend, only the Dragonborn can shout without training, the way the dragons do. Dragonborn? What are you talking really? about? That's right. My grandfather used to tell stories about the Dragonborn. Those born with the dragon blood in them. Like old Tiber Septim, said. I've never heard of Tiber Septim killing any dragons. Hmm. There weren't any dragons then, idiot. They're just coming back now for the first time in forever. But the old tales tell of the dragonborn who could kill dragons and steal the power. You must be one. I must be one. You say you're enough. You're being awfully quiet. Come on, Ilya. Tell us. Do you believe in this dragonborn business? Yeah, do you? <laughs> Some of you would be better off keeping quiet than flapping your gums on matters you don't know anything about. Here's a dead dragon, and that's something I definitely understand. Now we know we can kill them. But I don't need some mythical dragonborn. Someone who can put down a dragon is more than <laughs> enough for me. Well, I was the one you that got the last shot. Oscar. You ain't at all. I fall across Tamriel. I've seen plenty of things just as outlandish as this. I'd advise you all to trust in the strength of your sword arm over tales and legends. If you really mm. are dragonborn, like out of the old tales, you ought to be able to shout. Can you? Have you tried? I mean, I've never really tried it, but I guess I can. That was shouting, what you just did. You must be. You really are Dragonborn, <gasps> then. Hear that, Irleth? I'm actually a Dragonborn. I think 
I'll go ahead and loot what's on this dragon's body and uh, get going. I'm sure you guys don't really need me anymore right now. Well, there That was the hairiest fight I've ever been in, and I've been in more than a few. Yeah, I almost died there a couple times, to be honest. I don't know about this but I'm sure glad you're with us. Oh. You better get back to White One right away. Jarl Bagra will want to know what happened here. Alright, guess I'll see you guys in White Run. inside somewhere it looks like a storm's about to hit or something. Causing no trouble. All we ask is to look for her. I don't care what you're doing. After what happened, you're lucky I don't toss you in jail. Now get lost. We will be back. This is not over. You there. We're looking for someone in Whiterun. We'll pay good money for information. Who are you looking for? A woman. A foreigner in these lands. Redguard, like us. Huh. She is likely not using her true name. We will pay for any information regarding her location. Pay. We are not welcome here in Whiterun. So we will be in Rorikstead if you learn anything. Uh, who are you looking for again? We're looking for a fugitive who comes from Hammerfell. A Redguard woman. She may be somewhere in this city. Oh. Why do you need to find her anyway? It's none of your concern. All you need to know that we're paying for information. If that doesn't interest you, feel free to walk away. Well... If you locate her, find us in Rorikstead. Alright, I might take you up on this offer if I actually ever find someone like that. Well, it is nighttime, so I think I'd like to take a rest. Six, take some gold off of that guard that didn't make it, so maybe I'll have just enough to sleep indoors for once. Come on in, just stoke the fire. Take a seat and get the cold out. Hello. I enjoy this work well enough, but I'm ready to retire. I've been thinking of selling the inn to Isolda. Anyway, oh. what do you need? Who's Isolda? What can I get you? I'd like to rent a room. Sure thing. It's yours for a day. Thanks. 
I'll show you to your room, right this way. Thank goodness. Yes? The security in White Run is terrible. Shameful is what it is. Let me know if there's anything else you need. Thank you. Oh, what a nice room. I think we should definitely have a nice long rest. I'm feeling well rested. <laughs> okay, so um, we need to report back to the Yarl. Very quickly though, I'm going to check on something actually, S because I think, okay see, ah, so this playthrough, I started in hard, and this is the reason why that dragon almost killed me, because we're playing in master, instead of expert. And, uh, yeah, so I'm gonna keep playing it in Expert because that's what we were initially starting off with. Okay. Yeah. <sighs> we'll make that, hopefully not make that mistake again, because... The security in White Run is terrible. Shameful is what it is. Because that was a rough fight. <laughs> So maybe some other time I'll reveal your destiny. Mm -hmm. Tea leaves, palm weaving, crystal scrying. Ooh, maybe trepanning. <laughs> Those green apples you sold me really the other day were delicious. Yeah. Aren't they? I always set some aside for myself. When it's not easy being a woman in Skyrim, I know. But stay strong, and men will come to respect you, and maybe even fear you. Really? You think so? Well, I'm pretty sure men still fear me anyway. It's a shame, isn't it? What's a shame? I breathe now! I don't care if people fear me though. Got the fish to talk to. Hey Jarl. Killed that dragon. You're finally here. The Jarl's been waiting for you. You heard the summons. What else could it mean? The summons? The Greybeards. We were just talking about you. Sky? My brother needs a word with you. So what happened at the Watchtower? Was the dragon there? Oh, oh yep. Um, and it also turns out I may be something called the Dragonborn. Dragonborn? What do you know about the Dragonborn? Nothing, honestly. But that's just what the men called me. Not just the men. The Greybeards seem to think the same thing. The Greybeards? Who are they? Masters of the Way of the Voice. They live in seclusion high on the slopes of the throat of the world. Huh. What do you think that they want with me? The Dragonborn is said to be uniquely gifted in the Voice. The ability to focus your vital essence into a thule or shout. If you huh. really are Dragonborn, they can teach you how to use your gift. 
Interesting. Did you hear the thundering sound as you returned to Whiterun? I did, that actually. That was the voice of the Greybeards, summoning you to High Rothgar. Oh. This hasn't happened in centuries, at least. Not since Tiber Septim himself was summoned when he was still Talos of Atmora. Rungar, calm yourself. What does any of this Nord nonsense have to do with our friend here? Capable yeah, I'm as not she a may Nord. Be, I don't see any signs of her being this, what, dragonborn. Hey. Nord nonsense? Why, you puffed up ignorant. These are our sacred traditions that go back to the founding of the First Empire. Rongar, don't be so hard on Avenici. I meant no disrespect, of course. It's just that, what do these Greybeards want with her? That's what I want to know, too. That's the Greybeard's business, not ours. Whatever happened when you killed that dragon, it revealed something in you, and the Greybeards heard it. Mm. If they think you're dragonborn, who are we to argue? You'd better get up to High Hrothgar immediately. There is no refusing the summons of the Greybeards. It's a tremendous honor. Is it really? I envy you, you know, to climb the 7,000 steps again. I made the pilgrimage once. Did you know that? Really? You did? High Hrothgar is a very peaceful place. Very disconnected from the troubles of this world. I peaceful. wonder if the Greybeards even notice what's going on down here. They haven't seemed to care before. No matter. Go to High Hrothgar. Learn what the Greybeards can teach you. You've done a great service for me and my city, Dragonborn. By my right as Jarl, I name you Thane of Whiterun. I'm a it's the greatest Thane honor now. that's within my power to grant. Wow. I assign you Lydia as a personal housecarl, and this weapon from my armory to serve as your badge of office. I'll also notify my guards of your new title. Wouldn't want them to think you're part of the common rabble, now would you? We are honored to have you as Thane of our city, Dragonborn. Back that makes me feel special. Enters. We still have a city to defend. Yes, my lord. Well, guess I'll see what the Greybeards want from me. Jarl oh. has appointed me to be your house, Carl. It's an honor to serve you. Uh, what is a house, Carl, exactly? As my thane, I'm sworn to your service. I'll guard you and all you own with my life. Oh. Okay, well, I guess you can join me on my adventure if you really want to. Lead the way. Let's get going, shall we? Alright. I don't exactly know where the My Ismi, you did steps it. are. Kill the dragon. I did. Well, we gotta climb. With my mother, to sell fruits and vegetables. It's fun most days. You tried mercenary work? It might suit you. Mercenary work? I don't know about that. Oh, hey. Trella? We can never rest easy, for Balgraf's enemies will not. Hmm. I've got my eyes on you. Thanks. Well, Lydia, I don't know why you're wanting to join me on my adventure, but I guess... 
let's get going. There has been talk amongst the gods that you are a dragon. But such a thing, surely, is possible. It is possible. We're here to teach you a lesson. What? Never should have come here. <gasps> Won't leave here alive. What's happening? They look like guards. I was not expecting them to just outright kill me. I was not ready for it at all. And this is a bummer because I was actually excited to get back into this series, but well, I did say that this was going to be a permadeath character and unfortunately it looks like talks to fish adventures have come to a close and we're just gonna have to start a new adventure <laughs> with another character <sighs> well <laughs> I, g I guess that's it well that's okay. I will see you guys in the next Skyrim Let's Play series then. Bye! <laughs>